Hi, I'm Sam. And I'm Zach. What? What is? What is? And this is CCTV. Ah, CCTV. It takes a lot to make a stew. A pinch of salt and laughter too. A scoop of kids to add the spice. A dash of love to make it nice. And you got too many cooks. Too many cooks. Too many cooks. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. There will be an NHS fundraiser at Chick-fil-A in Alliance tonight. The next Falcon Friends meeting will be March 8th at 8 a.m. in M109. Spanish Club, there will be meetings February 25th and March 3rd at 7.45 a.m. in Senora Williams' room. Those that would like induction into this Spanish Honor Society, applications will be made available the week of March 7th from your Spanish teacher. Requirements are currently in a Spanish class and must be enrolled in a Spanish class through your time in NSHS. Two, a sophomore, junior, or senior. And three, have an 80 or higher cumulative semester average in Spanish pre-AP, Spanish AP class, or a 90 or higher communal co cumulative. cumulative semester average for Spanish on level. Four, in the second semester of Spanish two or higher and have three semesters of Spanish on your transcript. Five, Willing to do at least 15 hours of Spanish related community service school service this school year. for all ASL students, Friday, March 4th, 5 to 7 p.m. at Carroll High School, 800 in White Chapel, Southlake. Not Carroll Senior High. Don't, don't go there. They won't be there. There will be a silent dinner and games, a chance to meet lots of ASL students and practice your signing. All three of Timber Creek's ASL teachers will be there, and we are encouraging all ASL students to attend. Former ASL students are also invited. Sign up in ASL classrooms. Hello, Sam. Did you know that according to a state law and board policy, a student is required to be in attendance for at least 90% of the days that classes are offered? I didn't know that, Emily. Okay. Did you know that if a student violates this rule, they may be at risk for being denied credit for the course? No way. 
or more than nine absences in a first or fifth period, or more than four absences in a second, third, or fourth period, will result in credit denial per semester. Gosh darn it. Go to class, kids. I know. Want to get more graduation tickets so more of your family and friends can attend graduation? Yes, I do. To get more tickets, seniors will have to fill out a ticket declaration form from TCHS website or the office. Due date for the form is March 4th. The NHS can't, oh, okay. The NHS can't food drive is still going on until March 11th. The winner will have a pizza party. And that's all for your morning announcements. Have a great day. Bye.